a healer of blood pressure, and a protector of negative flow of energy is malachite stone, which you could find the rondel shape of this gemstone beads. 20 gauge wire and also 24 gauge wire is needed. Main tools, round nose pliers, chain nose pliers, and flush cutter. Insert the rondel malachite stone into 20 gauge wire and with round nose pliers make a very little loop at the end. This is a complete eye pin. We leave a space of about one centimeters then our stone would be placed and again one centimeters and a 90 degree bend. This size and distances could be different as the number of rows that you are wrapping the wire that we are going to make. Again, another eye pin at the end and make the wire strand all straight and cut it out in about 10 centimeters. And with the thinner wire of 24 gauge, I'm going to make a wire coiling and wire wrapping part, a very simple wire weaving, of course. I'm just wrapping the thinner wire all around. And this is going to be repeated for all of this length. So continue that till the end. Or simply, you could use this magic structure we had the tutorial on the link above. Simply make such a structure with 18 gauge wire and then wrap the thinner wire a 24 gauge all around and then like this just make a very beautiful wire coiling part so easily and then Insert it into the straight part of the wire and the length is about 8 centimeters. Then put the stone at the middle and then start wrapping this part of wire, the straight one of course, all around. This is the first wrapping part. And I continue that for the second row and you could continue weaving and wrapping this part as you desire. I just wrap for another round and then stop it but you could continue that for a longer weaving part and then place the bead wrap that coiling part all around and then again wrap this wire coiling part all around the main structure at this above part don't forget to squeeze and wrap the ending part completely all around and also if there is any sharp edges just squeeze it with chain nose pliers and push it so that there wouldn't be any sharp edges left and also firm and squeeze that ending part on the vertical wire and now I'm going to cut the extra part out because that's a little too long I had decided to make it a little shorter and at the end I'm going to make another eye pin just by making a little loop and then bend it at 90 degree. And this would be the main structure for my wire earring. Just one thing is missing, the dangling part. Pick up the 20 gauge wire again, make a very little loop at one side with round nose pliers, just put your round nose pliers round your hand to make a very little loop 
and then wrap it at the opposite side and somewhere in front of the loop make a bend and cut it out in about half of a centimeters then open up that very little loop on the hook and insert the main structure close that loop and that's ready a very beautiful wire earring but just one point you could benefit from this structure it could be a pendant and you insert chain on both ends and if you are a fan of pearls you could add two little ones what do you prefer without or with pearls please comment it below